Dear subscribers of Andranrulapam, we greet you in the precious name of our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ. Daily meditation for Tuesday, the 28th of May, 2024. The topic for the day is Families of the Earth. And in you all the families of the earth shall be blessed. Genesis chapter 12 verse 3 The Lord is blessing you and your family. He also blesses all the families of the earth. He changed the name of Abraham to Abraham to be blessing for many and said, No longer shall your name be called Abraham. But your name shall be Abraham, for I have made you a father of many nations. Genesis chapter 17 verse 5 If a man is righteous, if he loves God and does good to others, then for his sake the Lord will bless for a thousand generations. Lord Jesus was born on this earth after 42 generations from that of Abraham. In Abraham, all those generations were blessed by God. It was in the lineage of Abraham that great kings like David, Solomon and Rehoboam came and ruled over Israel. Once, when Lord Jesus came to the synagogue, he saw a woman who had a spirit of infirmity for 18 years, who was bent over and could not raise herself up. The Lord who wanted to heal her for the sake of Abraham asked, Ought not this woman, being a daughter of Abraham, be loosed from this bond on the Sabbath? Luke chapter 13 verse 16 he called her to him and loosed her from her infirmity. The Lord remembered Abraham when he met Zacchaeus. And Jesus said to him, Today salvation has come to this house because he also is a son of Abraham. Luke chapter 19 verse 9 the Lord who said that in Abraham all the families of the earth will be blessed, remembered Abraham and blessed Zacchaeus with the joy of salvation. When the father of a household is in an honorable position, his children will be respected in society. The children could also get many favors using their father's name. If the father is a righteous man, his children will find favor in the sight of the Lord. The Lord will bless your generations. When Apostle Paul writes to Timothy, he calls Timothy as a true son in the faith. Just like the blessings of a father is passed on to his children, the blessings of Apostle Paul came down upon Timothy. How can you be a spiritual father to others? You should look at them with fatherly love. Tell them the truths of the scripture and bless them. Do all what you can for them to grow in Christ and for their spiritual upliftment. People should be able to share their testimony about you and say, Sir, I was delivered from my sickness through you. It was through you I heard the good news and I am saved. When you prayed for me, I received the anointing of the Holy Spirit. Verse for further meditation. His name shall endure forever. His name shall continue as long as the sun. And men shall be blessed in him. All nations shall call him blessed. Psalm 72 verse 17. Today's Bible reading in the morning, 2 Chronicles chapters 4, 5 and 6. In the evening, John chapter 10 verses 24 to 42.